What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another Spencer TV video guys. We got a new mod in here, a new trailer mod by Lambo Mods. Guys, go check out his website, LamboMods.com. I'll link him below. We'll try and get a link in there for you guys. If you want to go check him out, he Lambo Bonds is an awesome modder, one of the, my favorite modders in, in the FS17 community. He really responds to what people want. And he comes out with a great mods. And he came out with like a three awesome awesome like car hauling trailer and that's what we're gonna be using today guys we're at the car dealership server map on gold crest here we have the squad semi the squad's peterbilt to be exact we're gonna hook up to the uh, supposedly three car trailer i think that's what it's called uh, the three car gooseneck uh trailer and we're gonna try and fit way more than three cars because you guys know this is spencer tv we outdo the standard okay let's get down the ramps there and let's see Let's just check out here. Let's get our controls. So engine brake off, trailer lights. Ooh, let's go trailer lights. Keypad eight, it's saying. Okay, so the trailer lights must not be working. I don't know. Um, It looks like we can lock the load by pressing V, remove ramps, X. Okay, makes sense, makes sense. And there we go, guys, check it out. So there is the uh, supposedly three car trailer. I think we can fit one car here. Oh yeah, it might only be three cars, guys. It's not. It's long, but it's not, it's still like with our trucks and a lot of the vehicles that we are going to be buying. They, it might not. It just might not work out. It might not work out. Okay, guys, we're gonna buy a yellow BMW i8. Guys, we're gonna be going around here and just be getting a lot of different stuff. And there we go. We'll get the Dodge. Oh, I was just on it. Was I not? What did I click? What did I click? Oh, where's that? Okay, there she is. There she is, boys. I get a white one. And then, yeah, so we're going to be hauling a bunch of cars. There's a bunch of uh, trucks that we need. We need orders filled. We're, we're missing out on some trucks. Some A lot of stuff is getting sold. So it's going to be a lot of trucks today because that's 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 what we're missing out. Inventory is running low. All right, let's take the BMW. Ooh, yellow. BMW i8, guys. It's pretty sick. And we are going to take this. Lop it up. Oh. There we go, guys. Hopefully you're having a good Friday. Yeah, I actually don't have school today, which is pretty awesome. It's like a teacher planning day. Where, uh, yeah, it, it's really nice. We can get a lot of videos done. Oh, oh, pop back up. There we go, Susan. Come on, get up on there. Make the world feel better. There we go. Okay, that's about right where it went off. Guys, we should be able to fit both trucks on there. Again, if we did cars, it would be a lot better, like a lot more room. But I wanna, I wanna test it. I wanna test Lambo's mod making skills. See if he, see if this trailer can handle the heat. Or it's gonna have to get out of the kitchen, boys. All right, come on, get as close as you can to the BMW. Holy Jimmy, you couldn't even fit, squeeze a quarter in there. Oh my, we aren't even touching, guys. Check that out. Yeah, can we see? We might, we might be, uh, we might be rubbing a little bit there. But okay, there doesn't look like a lot of room. Hopefully. <laughs> Guys, we have the crew cab extended bed, 30 Dodge 3500. Oh my goodness. There's no way she's going to fit. If she doesn't fit, we're going to have to buy it. Yeah. Oh, wait. Wait. There we go. Fifth perfect. You guys didn't see that. It, it wasn't touching the other truck at all. Okay, there we go. Oh, something. And if we hop out. Oh, no. All right, guys. The Dodge is just way too big. Maybe we're only going to be able to fit one truck at, on, on at a time. Dang it, boys! We were pushing. We were pushing our luck, and and our luck, it was it was too short. Okay, let's get another BMW on there. I know we were missing out on the SUVs. I think there's only one BMW SUV in stock right now, so this is gonna be a good buy and a uh, a good one to get down there ASAP because we need her. We need her. All right, there we go. It should ramp should be able to close. I wish. Like this kind of has the the frame and the look of you guys know like the two the two story car haulers. That's what we're kind of shooting here for. We were we were going for that like to get and you guys probably see them all the time on the interstate where it has one level with cars on it and then the other as well. And that's what we were shooting for. We we wanted to get a or I was looking on the market for a two story on like mod websites and stuff for two story car haulers, but this is absolutely awesome mod too. Thank you, Lambo, for making this really, really cool mod, guys. Again, go check him out. Link is gonna be below. You can like get his Patreon. He has so many cool military mods and a lot of mods that are kind of just like out there cool if you want to mess around, have some fun on FS17. But then there are some practical ones too. 
like this trailer okay let's slow down our giddy up it's getting a little laggy once we get the game has has to load the car dealership the car dealership is getting insane guys it's a little we were selling a lot today because it's coming up on weekends weekends are our best time for selling our best time okay let's pull in here it's gonna take a second to load up all right so there we are it's starting to load it up a little bit it is a little laggy like it always did I, I i never think we're gonna i i don't think we're ever gonna like really get away from how laggy it is okay so other trailer companies must have been delivering more cars here today oh jimney so let's get these on out of here i don't know are they inside getting coffee i don't what what, what are they doing um how do i oh wait there we go perfect fire up let's pull her out of here we're gonna have to make room keep things moving so customers have room to get in here guys we can't block it off with all these peter bolts unless they want to see us like unload which they don't they want to buy buy some real nice cars here guys there we go and let's shut her down right there there we go guys so and then i want to grab the other this is actually a volvo as well as you can tell guys like when i'm walking and stuff it is a little uh it's not lagging it's just a little i'm sure there's a word for it just the just the frame rate and the pixels they just aren't up to par like they usually are but that's just because we got to load all that stuff in there we go everybody we got those two parked off on the side so we can get some work done let's fast to see it's just everything is just slower you need to slow slow it down a little bit when we get in here all right guys check out these awesome new trailers the three car i, I love this trailer it looks super good now if we all maybe we shouldn't get trucks next time because it takes up a lot it takes up a lot of room but uh we'll see we'll see what we can get down here guys you don't see that no no damage was uh brought to any vehicles here today guys don't worry don't worry about that customers didn't see that okay there we go let's pull it up crank it over we haven't sold any i8s what's going on salesman where's my salesman at i don't even see him walking around what is going on maybe guys maybe we're gonna have to buy it buy an i8 but we do have some deliveries we have two vehicles that are that have sold and the customer applied for the uh for the delivery package they bought the delivery package because they didn't i don't know it must be a present or something or they want to surprise somebody so what they, what they want us to do is that they deliver it to the house so at the end of the video we're going to be delivering two cars one is a bugatti and then one is a is our chevy dually pickup pickup trucks so i will be we'll be do we'll be getting that done today which is really cool i love delivering vehicles to people's houses which is absolutely awesome and it kind of makes us like get out of our routine of just delivering cars in stock here most of the cars aren't even delivered people just take them home which is totally cool and like normal and yeah so there we go we got to get the i8 off of here the yellow i8 never seen before fresh on the market looking good like always honestly i kind of like it kind of it's got like an easter easter kind of vibe to it i don't know looks really cool guys the i8 is just cool cool little car oh there we go taking some curbs out on our way over okay now we're adding the yellow to the collection i a lot of you guys said white um, i would say the majority of comments were white you guys wanted white bmw i8s i don't know i'm still i'm, I'm staying on the black okay guys we're gonna fly back to the shop and get some we're gonna take another load of hopefully we can get three vehicles on here if we're gonna be taking that ram it's gonna be a tight squeeze the other two have to be absolutely tiny so there we go guys we're gonna crank it over and then we still got to sell stuff too so we still got we're about a third of the way there on um on our task today so there we go guys let's fly back over here or wait why don't we just deliver them right now yeah that would make sense so holy cow we're taking up traffic all right let's go yeah that was a waste we should just deliver them on our way to the shop because it's all in town and it'll save us some time so there we go guys let's drop the ramps back so what was the order list okay it was a bugatti so we're gonna go grab one of them and then they wanted the red chevy silverado 3500 dang it the the view just went out see that happens with the chevy we're gonna have to go first person we're go we're gonna have to load this up first person which might be a little difficult all right let's crank it over holy lag come on bessie 
yeah see guys look at the view i don't know the modder of this like really messed up sometimes sometimes modders take shortcuts lambo like never does all his mods are pretty like perfect i guess some mods just can't be perfect but yeah his are like super good again guys go check him out see like it's just what even is this is this real life i don't know all right let's just is it good right there we could probably move it up just a hair oh well okay that's good and then hopefully the bugatti can fit on here guys we need locker load last time or maybe i did i don't know but we need to this time it takes a while for these bugattis to start up check these out bugatti chiron chiron Ch -ch 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 i don't know i i'm not too familiar with bugatti models because you know we don't got millions of dollars out here all right there we go let's load them up come on big cat get up there oh perfect good thing this thing's low we would have took her out okay this time we're locking the load because we got a very expensive load back there v is to lock it maybe the ramps have to shut down all right just press v it is okay just press v again and it doesn't switch to like okay well we're gonna have to be careful for some reason either my v on my keyboard is not working or the load doesn't lock and it's false advertising i know i don't know anyway there we go we got to fly into goldcrest town oh crank it over we almost hit the green bugatti we just took out a tesla it doesn't matter we got to get to where we're going no that's just bad driving my special tv all right get out there get on the road there we go we should be pulling out here the, the glitchiness should be going away here very shortly all right come on there it is okay we're good nice see now it's clean it's fresh it's normal everything's good check our mirrors check our mirrors the mirrors are only important in the right direction what's going on all right slow it down we were going a little, like 25 over the speed limit there we go guys keep coming up here it's gonna be on our left for both these vehicles the the bugatti goes to this brown house right here on the street super duper nice house all right crank it over and if i were to order a bugatti i would want it to deliver to my house because like that's so cool having we got having a bugatti delivered to your house that'd be awesome okay there we go so the loads the load does a lot guys so we don't really need to worry about that when we unload these bad boys so there we go again it takes a quick second zt fast one i love the license plate beautiful crank her over and then let's just yeah back her in that looks real nice guys that looks super nice check it out check it out there we go they're gonna be happy when they come home and they have a brand new two million dollar car in their driveway there we go okay so we're gonna go down here everybody and then on the right is going to be our next house down here on our we're gonna take a right turn and go down here a ways i got it on my phone looking at the gps okay yeah we're good hopefully nobody just takes us out in here because guys if you if you guys didn't know i found this statistic the other day the most dangerous driving you can do like the where you're at most risk of crashing is when you're by your house so like neighborhoods if you think about it are actually like kind of dangerous to drive because everybody's so familiar and think they're thinks they're like a boss at driving in the hood but they really aren't okay there we go anyway that was just kind of off topic i just read that the other day there we go let's unload this check our mirrors big cats all right i'm just gonna put it on the curb and there we go shut her down on the curb looks super duper nice nice truck nice everything everything it looks really nice about it i just did nice like five times in a row there all right let's go over here hopefully we can get the ram loaded up and two like smaller cars as well smaller vehicles and hopefully we can fit all three on here the more the merrier each trip we got to take a lot on there so we get so it's like worth the we get a bang for a buck you know what i mean guys it's worth the the cost of us driving down there there we go every vehicle we delivered we get paid quite a bit for and we want to keep inventory up so each one counts oh it drops through like come on oh no oh no the trailer the trailer's going crazy it can handle it though a really guys let me know what you think of the trailer i think it's really really cool really good trailer in general like it's just it's it's shiny it looks good 
there's nothing too like crazy about it everything you know like works really nice there we go let's go misc all right let's look for do we have any other vehicles that we need to take down there oh there's the bronco guys i'm pretty sure the bronco like destroys the game if you put it in there should we grab a jeep oh my no we need a sadie's we need a we need a mercedes and there's that and then we'll take a tesla because i accidentally ran over one on our way through here and there's only two left so there's one mercedes left on the lot in stock and then there's one tesla the thing about the tesla is it's pretty long along with the mercedes so i don't know how this is gonna fit the bugatti or not the bugatti but the uh the i8 was was not as like guys the tesla is a big a big girl she's long same with the mercedes guys this i don't know how this is gonna fit we might have to drive with, yeah i don't think this is gonna work or we could sketchily we could do something really sketchy are you guys down i think you guys are down check this out we could do something super duper sketchy what i'm gonna do driving down there is i'm gonna keep pressing x all right, so we're going. All right. Maybe, could we just drive like that? Or do, does the Mercedes want to fall off? Yeah, if we just keep pressing X. You guys see what I'm doing back there? We just keep pressing. Oh, she's goner. She's a goner. We'll come back and pick up the Mercedes on our way back. There we go. What happened to the Tesla? Why is it scooching back so much? Oh, well, there we go. We had two cars on here. Dang it. And, and we, and we like, lost the Mercedes. Anyway, guys, there we go. We're flying back. The, if you guys... Guys, look at the dot. The, the, the Ram. The 3500's tires on there. Does that not look, like, unusually skinny? Oh, I thought we were going to have to floss the needle there. Thread the needle. There we go. So, the tires on that look super duper skinny. Maybe because they, they, like, the modder was like, okay, it's getting too wide. If you put really, really, like, thick tires on there, it's going to look crazy because they're, they're dualies and it's going to, like, stick out a bunch. But, guys, look at the, the rear tires on that. Look so out of place, out of whack, and, like, not proportionate to the body of the truck. That's insane. It looks like little. Oh, my goodness. I don't know. That's weird. Just, I, I just caught it today. It, I really like the truck, but now that I see that, I'm like, what the heck? All right, there we go. Things got a little rough on the way here. The Dodge is about to fall off. There we go. Take the ramps down. Unload these two. The Mercedes. I don't know what we're doing. It. We might. We we might just have to keep it at the shop because that is gonna be it for us today, guys. Hopefully, you enjoyed this new trailer. We got to we got to use it, and it helped us out a bunch. I love how the Tesla makes literally like a construction equipment sound when you back up. But, you know, safety first. We got to make sure everybody hears us when we back up. Because so we could run them over. There we go. There's not a lot of room right there on next to the workshop or the uh, the showroom. The Dodge is falling off quick. The trailer's still holding it on there. Buy a hair. Come on, baby. Come on. Oh, we're, we're on two wheels. We are on two wheels, everybody. All right, there we go. Unload this. But, guys, the new trailer did awesome. Really cool. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. The trailer did a great job. Peter Bolt, nice job. Again, go check out LemonMods.com. A beast modder, the best modder in the game. Hope you guys did enjoy. Peace out, and I'll see you tomorrow.